Solo Q time. 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 Playing some Aegislash. Slash. Uh, I still think this is probably my favorite character to play, even though it's not very great. And looking at what's happening. Oh man, skipping everything. Looking at these lanes, I am not ganking the Cinderace lane. I do be not ganking Cinderace lanes. We cannot be feeding into that kind of deplorable behavior. Look at the stacking of the champ. You stacking, bro. You stacking. Leaving the Cinderace to chill in the bush all alone. Yo, do we gank this early? Yo? Hey, yo? Hey, yo, y'all got scurred. All right. Back in the jungle I go. Got time to make it to A50s, right? Dang, look at that level five gank though. Dang. Almost a kill, almost a kill. I respect it, I respect it. I have time to make it to the bottom, bottom lane. Nice, nice, good damage, good damage there. We're gonna focus these a little bit. If they step forward, we're gonna get aggresso. Nice, that's what we like to see. And we're gone. Nice and gone. Now we go to the jungle again. We get back in the jungle. Alright. This will spawn at a little under 720s based on when I kill it. So 716, so I might sack my bees. We'll see. Maybe depending on how my next gank goes and how fast I can kill this. My clear's not the fastest in the world. It's not that bad. Put both of those right as dread spawning, which in solo queue, not so bad. They probably will not flip it. Alright, we're gonna hit our wide guards. I'll let him get that, he needs it. Wait, we need to go defend this. This could be a profitable gank. Get the knock up. Alright, there. Ah, good dash. Oh, ooh, ooh. You have a focus band on. Oh, no way, huh? I mean, we'll take that. I'm gonna get it either way. Alright. Let's go for that blue buff and then we'll do a sm we'll do a half rotation. So we'll get blue into bottom lane. That should get me my nine. Hopefully they can hold that. Come on now. I believe in you. I believe in you, Lucario. I'm watching Lucario's health bar right now. Don't want them to full rip. They haven't they haven't fully ripped yet. Look at this knockbacks, double knockbacks. He's gonna dash away. We, we dash in. Now we pop the full heal. We walk away from that. That's the level nine. And now we pop off here. Look at the, look at the double knockbacks. Ah, oh, I thought she was gonna step away. So miss my unite move there. But it should be okay. All right. Big pop off there. We're gonna go for the Dreadnaw now. Yes. The infamous Dread. Mr. Gnaw. See, Mr. Gnaw is actually not the father. You wouldn't know it. Alright, get the double knockback. We have lots of stacks here, so we're gonna pop all of them on player damage. All right, and as this is actually distracted, I'm gonna get this score in so we get a full break in here, nice. Get some knockback on this Wiggly. We'll full heal that, and now this kind of using the Wiggly to get this kill that I'm not gonna get because I did not quite secure it. I, I actually have to back up, I'm sorry. I can't actually help you too much there. Okay, but if he's gonna step into me, then I can definitely do plenty of things here. Like, use a Unite move, even though I missed it. It's fine. Again. 
We'll kite him back so that way I pull him off of his own uh, his own goal there. That's fine. Let's see what's going on up here. I don't know if I can stop that. I don't think so. Not with two of them on. Just unfortunate because that is a, quite a bit of turn in there. I don't want him to surf me, so I'm gonna dance around over here. Which I will get this again, and we're gonna use this for a knockback. Kind of keep him in place at minimum. All right, so we take him down. It's unfortunate they got so much turn in, but you know, it happens. It happens. Oh, that's a snapback, which is also unfortunate. But again, it happens. I can focus on hitting this for a bit. Ah, now we go in. You see? Now I need my teammates to follow up with me a little bit. Nice. We get that. We get control of that. They do still have quite a good number of people here, but now we'll go in. We'll get the double, triple knockbacks, big knockbacks, spam healing myself, going in for the big damage. Now we're spamming, trying to rely on the Rotom a little bit. Big knockbacks again. Go for the Wiggly. Nice. Beautiful fight. Beautiful fight. Just gotta finish it. Ah, unfortunate. Just had to finish that up, but not bad, not bad. I mean, we're, we popped off there. That's why I love Aegis Slash, man. It's all about decision making and like trying to outplay them and like you do need that follow-up sometimes though because like you go in sometimes you're in um try not to spam your abilities too much but know when you can use your charges and things of that nature so nice all right lots of farm up lots of farm up well that's what we're gonna focus on right here lots of farm you'd be in sword stance right now Not as easy. They they kind of shadow nerfed. Hopefully that's a small dunk. Ugh, it's not, but honestly, we kind of need it gone anyways. I'll take the farm. Um, they kind of made it a little bit harder to spam wide guard for stacks, so it's a little harder to pre like prepare yourself. They kind of like nerfed, like stealth nerfed it. It's a little annoying. I'm not really sure why they did it, but um, wide guard you can't quite spam it as much to build your stacks. So just a little annoying detail, something to think about. Not sure, again, why they did it, but I'm going to get 14, which is nice. I'll be pushing for 15, potentially. And if nobody goes top lane, then I'll get this Robert for free. Mm, they got a lot of turn in. Hopefully we're good. I'm going to see if there's any bees up here. Okay. So, we'll... Don't know if I'm actually gonna do this. I'm not gonna do it. I'm just gonna be up here. Want to build some stacks up? He misses. Yo, my champ, my champ. I'm only going in because he's in. You know, some big knockups there. That actually, some that could be a big ult. Big, big damage on the sender. Okay, good, good kill on the sender. Got some knockback here. Big damage. Well done. Alright, we have three down. Honestly, we could probably rip this. They do have the Cinder up still. Nice. We knocked that up. Just trying to keep the Cinder busy, 2VH. Nice. Kind of doing my job as like the half tank to zone. All right, let's get out of here. Used a full heal there. We're gonna go ahead and focus on scoring. I love Aegislash Slash so much. I really do. This character feels so strong when it when it goes well. Right? I should just back and defend. I don't know why I'm not. We had huge lead, so we were fine. Doesn't really matter. Even after their scores, it doesn't really matter. Go fight though. Because why not? See how much he can do to me here. Not really a ton. We just heal. Yep. Let's see, where are you at, Pikachu? Let's fight. Let's fight, Pikachu. I just want to fight people. I just want to end my game off on a good note. Just hang out with me, bro. Yo, hang out with me. Yo. Come on, man. You gotta act like that. Let me heal up. 
We're just vibing, you know? Yeah, we're just vibing. Yeah, we're vibing, you know? We're vibing, you know? You can't kill me. You you can't do it. You're you're not gonna kill me because <laughs> I'm tanky <laughs> as hell. <laughs> GG's. So there you have it, friends. I just felt like playing a game. Thought maybe you'd like to come along the journey with me. I love Age of Slash. I think it's one of my favorite characters to play in the entire game. Just so fun to go in and out of your different uh, sword dancing, and the character's not some crazy superstar on the field, right? Like I, that was actually a big game for me. I did 78k damage. I'm in my mostly tank build. Like mostly, I have weakness policy, 11 kills. Just like. Use and unite move pretty often. Like it's another one of those like almost near Pikachu kind of unite moves where you just want to spam it. Like if you have it, use it when you can. And um, wide guard, sacred, you know, sacred sword, pretty fun stuff. So thank you so much for watching. I definitely appreciate it. As always, friends, drop a comment, drop a like on the video if you haven't already. Subscribe to the channel as well. Be sure to be kind to of one another. Tell someone that you love them, and I'll see you on the next video.